Hello everyone, how are you doing? Today we're going to be... Whoa, okay. What, why Why is that there? Where? Where is that music coming from? Bro, oh, I'm not in the movie. I'm, I'm not in the movie. I'm not in the... That's right, I'm going to show you how to make these quick and simple cinematic bars in DaVinci Resolve. Let's get to it. Okay, so I've just gone on some random stock footage website and found this video clip. It's literally just a grown footage of a car. That's a pretty nice clip. I'm going to mute the audio so it doesn't get annoying. All right, there are many ways that you can create these cinematic bars. This is how I'm going to show you. First, you're going to go into the effects on the left hand side, drag an adjustment clip over your footage. And the reason we're using an adjustment clip is so that we're not directly affecting the original video later, so we can still move this about and do whatever we want with it. Okay, now we're going to go to this adjustment clip. We're going to scroll down in the inspector tab. You can toggle it at the top here. You can scroll down double click cropping and you can see if you move the top and the bottom we've got our own uh, cinematic bars so let's move the bottom to halfway well actually I'll have to see what halfway is 1080 so halfway is going to be 540 same with the top 540 okay now we're going to create some keyframes by clicking the diamonds here and here we're going to go forward a few frames by pressing the right arrow key one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten why not and then we're gonna drag these back to zero instead of dragging you could also double click the attribute name and there we have it now that's an opening but if you want the cinematic bars to stay all we have to do is go to the second set of keyframes we made and just put the top and the bottom to whichever position we want you want to make sure that these two numbers are the same so that the bars are the same uh, height and it looks equal and there we have it very nice you could use alt and scroll to zoom in and drag the keyframe out so that it takes a lot more time that was a lot slower you can make it even slower there we go look at that and now the next thing I'm going to show you is how to make them come from the top down. It's very simple. It's using the same idea of animating the crop function. So I'm going to hide this adjustment layer and I'm going to drag in another one above to show you with that one. We're going to do the same thing, but instead we're going to go to the beginning and create keyframes for the top and the bottom. And then we're going to go to wherever we want the bars to come in and then give ourselves the bars, the cinematic bars like so so now we've got this and they come from the top and the bottom instead of opening from the middle and there we have it two different styles so we've got the one coming from the top and the bottom and then we've got the one coming from the middle there's two ways to do cinematic bars you're welcome